Hi friends, uh, welcome back to the second last episode. That's the sixth episode of Cycle Your Success. I'm sure you have loved all the five episodes. This is the sixth episode. So the five episode, what I've done is I've created the problem. You know what could be the problem? What could be your belief system? What could be not helping you succeed in life? Now this is the episode and the last episode where we're going to give you the solution. So it's very important that you you know go through those episodes and then come here, or even if you come here, just go and learn and understand and implement. And as I rightly said, action time. You know it's not just just you just you read it and you kind of heard it. You need to take action. All right. So f- few things that I would like you to uh, go ahead and you know also refer back. If you remember, I talked about the letting go, right? The letting go. How the monkey is killed. How the letting go. Now that letting go also. Um, what I wanted to mention was sometimes you are holding on to few customers who are actually exploiting you in a big ways. It it happens many a time that you feel that they are the only customers around, and you do your best, but you don't get paid enough, right? It's a time to let go because, as I said, in the jungle there are lots of fruits and vegetables that you can have. There are lots of other people. We do a lot in terms of digital marketing and internet marketing, online marketing, where we help you identify new customers. So if you are stuck with few customers. Get in touch with us. We can actually help you get new customers for any kind of business that you have, right? So that's what it is. Um, let go of everything that you feel is stopping you to do or to achieve your goals, right? The second thing, um, and uh, what I wanted to tell you was, uh, as I said, I'm going to talk about the solution. So as I mentioned, there is a. Uh, blueprint that is there the money blueprint the relationship blueprint which we need to reprogram right if there is something which is not working if there is something which is not helping you succeed if there is something which is not helping you grow if there is something which is blocking your relationship it's time to change it right if you continue doing it and you feel with time it's going to maybe with time it's going to, but it's going to take a lot of time are you ready to wait for 10 years 15 years to make a change or you want it now it's always about the fast mover it's always a person who gets an idea and implements it so we're going to give you something which you're going to implement it you know you see this uh, baba ramdev and patanjali coming up right fast mover they all the different corporate godrej actual different companies which are not able to compete why because he's a fast mover he got all the inputs from everybody he implemented it and now he's growing he's growing at fast pace yeah so you need to be a fast mover you just can't just be listening as i said you need to be excited about it now is the time that you're going to get some solutions right so first thing that i'm going to talk about is is basically in terms of what you can do in terms of declarations right so some of the declarations that we have got, i have written and um, i've got it from my gurus and which i practice it every day which is making huge huge difference you want to know more about it i sure i sure you want to do it all right so let me tell you about this is about living on purpose so what i'm going to read for you is this is a declaration that we do in terms of changing the blueprint what is say i am important you are important right raise your hand I am important. I am important. I have important work to do. I was sent here for a reason. I fulfill my mission. As I said, everybody is part of a jigsaw puzzle, and you need to work on your mission. If you work, there are other people around you who are dependent on you. If you don't work what you're supposed to do, there are others who will not be able to complete the jigsaw puzzle. It's very important to complete your mission. I live my vision. Whatever is your vision, whatever is a goal, whatever you want to achieve, you need to live your vision. I make a difference to the people life always always you know I have met people who come and say well this is what I what I what I feel I should care that's wrong you make a difference you know one of my gurus that say repeat I create value for my customers I'm in coaching I always used to think that you know this is the amount I should charge but he made me think differently I create value for my customers that's what you always say I create value for my customers and you should deserve more than what you're getting paid right I am the warrior of light this is my destiny so I you have to repeat these things so every person is different we help you create these declarations for you based on the kind of work you do and who you are this is my declaration which I read and I I, I repeat it every time apart from that there's something else so as i said in the morning it's very important to get up right it's only important to get up at 5 or 6 after that you're charged up so once you've done that 
the next thing that you have to do is you do your meditation which i'm going to tell you after this so this episode we going to refer to the meditation which is at the last next what you going to do is you go to the mirror right and then in, in front of the mirror you stand right and this may sound slightly crazy but yes this is something which is really worked and as i said i've been i've been trained by international trainers one of the trainers that told me is go in front of the mirror and say hey i love you neeraj i love you this is what i do right it sounds crazy but the crazy people are the one who make a difference it's not the ordinary people ordinary people jo kiyo makore jaise chalte rehte hain jo roz ek hi cheez karte hain to wo nahi agar aapko kuch badalna hai zindagi mein to aapko crazy banna padega you need to bounce back raise your hand raise your hand like this i'm going to bounce back i'm going to bounce back every time any time there is obstacle in your in your life you need to say i'm going to bounce back i'm going to come back i can do it so always remember this hand and say i'm going to bounce back right so you want to bounce back so if you want to really bounce back and you feel that you want to do something like go in front of the mirror after you done the exercise and say neeraj i love you it's important to love yourself i love you you're great you are absolutely awesome you are unstoppable i love you you can do it you can do it you can do it you can do it you are great you're genius love yourself keep on telling it to the mirror do it thrice do it twice as many a time as you can i prefer doing it five times a week it really helps me increase my spirit you know myself i start loving myself and i can do myself much better think about it you it, it may sound crazy but this is what it is this is a solution yes it's simple it's simple but try it no harm as i said 21 days nothing if you if you see this changing happening in the environment around you you feel the difference right that's one part of it secondly is affirmations this is my this is my affirmation diary right and this is where i every day write my affirmations right so if you see all this are affirmations on a daily basis now there are different ways of it one you can write these affirmations like affirmation says like i give you an example life is wonderful there are lots of prosperity and happiness in my life every day i'm growing i'm learning i'm making friends and it's a great life for me so these are some of the basic assumption affirmation that i'm going to talk about right and you need to repeat it write it so that it starts reprogramming your mind so this is my affirmation diary it it, it basically one you need you can write it secondly you have ways you know you have a counter now next time when i have it i'll show you there's a counter just count every affirmation for 200 times it's reprogramming your brain it's to become programming your subconscious mind right and then the third thing that you can also do is you can record those information affirmation so if you are we are driving just let it play you know it could be that there could be issues with the relationship you can say i have a great relationship there is good issue money money is flowing in abundance i have got lots of money coming into it so that's reprogramming yourself if what happiness and all i am very happy with whatever i have i am great happiness is coming to me so those are some of the things that you have to keep on doing right so i said exercises meditation uh, affirmations declaration love yourself you know and uh, do these you know do this uh, and goal settings right whatever is goal settings and all we can help you create those goals for you we can help you create what kind of goals are there and that goal settings would reflect everywhere that you are trying to do right uh finally uh, that's something which terms of that's again for me that's the commandments we are talking of code of honor right i work a lot in terms of the code of honor now there's a book uh, from again my one of my gurus and that talks about uh, the team code of honor right that talks about the code of honor now uh, one of my books that got fell <laughs> the entrepreneur's truth yeah this talks about the different entrepreneurs and the journeys and what they should do now code of honor i picked that up from the code of honor so i i can i don't have time that i will take you through lot maybe you can connect me uh, send me a mail and then i'll tell you what kind of code of honor you can write so some of the quotes that i read seek success by reading hearing and meeting success people for some time every day that's a code of honor for me when obstacles comes when the issues comes some people just go astray i have created a code of honor for myself i i i work on it every day and i live with it right so that's very important whatever i really believe in always happens it is the belief that makes things happen code of honor that's the second code of honor for me let me take you to the last two the obstacle of your past can become the gateway that always lead to the new beginning any time an obstacle comes for me i am happy about it 
fine an obstacle is calm it's definitely going to help me you know improve it's going to help me having more strength in life i'm going to succeed so create up you know whenever the obstacle comes take it happily this is like a you know a blessing from from the from the universe not all obstacles comes in the form of great gifts some of the obstacle can come you know in 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 manner where it can create a pain for you but those pains are helping you grow so there are gifts of life would you remember that the obstacles are gifts of life take it do not feel sad about it do not say why me mujhse kya ho raha hai bhagwan mere paas kyun bheja tujh paas bheja hai because they he wants you to take care of the obstacle not avoid them overcome that obstacles do whatever you know if this is obstacle go under over sideways do whatever to overcome those obstacles great speeds are always encountered wallet opposition from medical mind whenever i try to do something you know anything that i'm doing crazy anything that i'm doing different lots of people came for you also if you implement all this the lots of people say pagal hai kya those are the people who are medical mind they don't want to grow remember you are the five people that you surround with so if you are currently surrounded with the people who are pulling you down get out of it get out i'm not asking to leave them me people who are aspiring who want to grow so you are the average of five people that you hang around with so think about whom you hang around with think about what you want and then decide what you want so please i request you whatever i told you in terms of affirmations and all if you don't understand feel free to connect to me and i will give you more detail thanks very much uh, love you this is the sixth episode the last one don't miss it i'm talk- i'm going to talk about the meditation which is a very important component because apart from all this it's very important to cool my mind and meditate and think about the growth and that's the part of success thanks very much love you guys catch you in the last episode thanks very much bye bye